guys I was following the GPS and now I'm stuck <laughs> like this guy tried to help me but there's no way I'm literally stuck on this road and I'm late to work <laughs> oh my god guys It, guys it was a struggle but the police officer helped me get out of that incline like I was stuck on a hill the police officer came and helped me get out of it which is good and now I'm at the client and luckily I wasn't the only one that was late the manager he also came from where I live and he got here late too and I had to come to my office after driving an hour and 25 minutes. Um, but I had to come to my office so that I can pick up a 10 key, um, a portable monitor and a mouse, which I was not given last week and I forgot to ask for. So it was hard today working on one monitor, but I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good morning guys, it's 6.30 and I'm on my way to work. It's gonna be like an hour, hour and a half drive, depending on the weather. So, see you guys there. I worked through lunch today so that I can leave early because I don't want to drive when it's too dark. And it's like an hour and a half drive back home. So I am leaving now. And um, yeah, it's so cold. It's so cold. Here is my outfit today. Today is Wednesday. So you guys know all of this already. But Zara, JCPenney, Zara, ASOS. H&M so yeah so guys today I am NOT at my client I am working from the office because like I told you guys I've been driving I've been driving an hour and 20 minutes each way um, to go to my client and like the first day I got stuck in the snow and today supposed it said it was supposed to be snowing like starting at 3 so I didn't think it necessary for me to drive there like leave my house at six get there and then leave there around like one or two so I can get home before it starts snowing um so I'm just working from the office all day today um and the other team members they live on that side like they live closer to the client um and then only me and the manager we live on this side so yeah <sighs> it's been rough but I got to sleep in a little bit today the client that we're on is a 930 year-end client that's when their fiscal year ends so I'm testing cash uh, PP&E property plant and equipment um, I'm t which is fixed assets I'm testing accounts payable and then I'm doing some stuff within the financials like the subsequent events related parties things like that so that's what I'm working on Yesterday, I finished up my cash testing, which was testing cash cutoff and bank confirmation, making sure what the amounts that they have in their uh, GL, their general ledger for their bank statements is what the bank confirms. So I did finish pretty much done with cash. I'm gonna wrap up my accounts payable testing today once I get the support back from the client. And then now I'm about to go back to my desk and work on the fixed assets. So the property plant and equipment testing. Um, so that I could be at a good spot by the end of the week. So that's a little update as to how my audit is going. When you're at the client, like we have a little conference room. It's like a glass square table and there is the first day there was six of us. And then yesterday there was three of us because the partner didn't come, the manager didn't come, and the senior didn't come. They worked from the office and stuff. So yeah that's about how it is like you're in a small conference room and you guys are all on the table working together so that's a little update on how audit's going i'll see you guys later 
hey guys so today is thursday and i'm about to wrap up the vlog here because nothing interesting is really going on for the rest of the week so we pretty much have our audit finished for this client and the manager already started reviewing a lot of stuff and we started uh signing off on things so it's pretty much good to go and because of that i did not have to go back out there today and i'm not going out there tomorrow i don't think anybody is the team all the guys that live closer to there they're going out there just to wrap stuff up but i don't even think they're gonna stay there for the whole day they're probably gonna leave early today and then no one's gonna be out there tomorrow so we're pretty much done with the audit hope you guys enjoyed and kind of got an actual idea of what an auditor does um during the week so yeah see you guys here is my outfit today i got this from the ann taylor ann taylor outlet here um and then just black sweater leggings and boots and just an advice technically you're sh you shouldn't wear leggings to work um and it's usually in like the rule, like in the dress code guidelines. And however, you need to learn how to dress it up. So I have thick leggings. These are really thick leggings. Um, and I always wear leggings with something long to cover my back area. Um, that's how you can get away with wearing leggings to work, FYI, yeah.